Hello all. In this session, we are going to discuss regarding the fundamental rights of human. Under the Indian Constitution, Article 12 to Article 35, discuss regarding the fundamental rights of human. I am Hardik Patel from SN Patel Engineering College, Umrak, Bardoli. This subject is Indian Constitution, subject code 313007. This subject is for all the branch, for all the branch. Now we all are getting so benefits from the other like uh, from the equalities from the freedom for the speech we have the so many liberties okay we have so many liberties these things called the rights as a human rights now the question has been arised why we get such type of freedom such type of rights such type of rights so every people have a right a right to speak every people have a right to accept any religions why because which is mentions in the constitution which already mentioned in the constitution so constitutions the important part say every coin is a two side head and tail so head side we have a rights and tail side we have a duties it's called fundamental duties that article 51a here i am discussing regarding only that one side that is a fundamental rights that means we all get the benefit we all get the benefits Okay, so fundamental rights are the essential human rights that offer to every citizen irrespect of caste, race, crowd, uh, place of birth, religions or a gender. Here there is a no discrimination at all. When there is a no discrimination, it means all the people get the equal chance. Suppose I am a black, so it does not mean that black and white. Suppose a black person get the same benefit and the white uh, the, uh, the color is doesn't matter. Meanwhile, region. Suppose I am X regions, you are a Y regions. Means all the people get the equal chance. Okay. So doesn't mean that caste, race. Then after the uh, place of birth. Okay. These are the factors that we think that uh, we thought that it's a different. Okay. But is all things are remain same. Means each and every person get the same benefit get the same benefit that's why this equals to freedom and these rights are the essential of person personal goods and the society at large it is not applicable for phone for example i am a doing a crime so i am the responsible i i need to go for the prison so i just break the law just due to the break the law i get the punishment Okay, suppose you do the same thing, you also get the same thing. There is no partiality between you and me, between X gender to Y gender, X region to the Y regions. All people have a equal presence and all people give a equal rights. Okay, so basic we have a six fundamental rights. Basic six fundamental rights. The first one, rights to equality. Number two, rights to freedom. Number three, rights to freedom from exploitations. Number four, rights to freedom of religions. Number five, uh, then cultural and educational rights. And the last one, rights to constitutional remedies. So based on the six rights that distributed the article 12 to article 35. Now first, we are discussing regarding that rights to equality which is cover under the article article 14 to article 18 article 14 to article 18 which is rights to equality next rights to freedom this article cover 19 to 22 19 to 22 then after rights to rights to freedom from exploitations article 23 to article 24 then after rights to freedom of religions which cover under the article 25 to 28 then after cultural and educational rights which is cover 28 29 and 30 and last from uh, that 30 to 35 which is a constitutional remedies constitutional remedies now we take one by one first now look at the first that is 
rights to equality all people have a equal things equal things okay so equality for what equality for what equality before the law then after prohibition or discriminations on the ground prohibitions totally prohibited for the race that sex that means gender then after place of birth caste nothing get equal opportunity for the job also absolute untouchabilities and absolute of the titles okay so article 14 15 16 17 and 18 which relevant with the rights to equality okay so now article 14 this constitutions is give a guarantee for the all the citizen have the equal protected by the law equal chance equal there is no discrimination for you law is different and for me the law law has been different no all the people have the equal rights and equal law then after uh, that next is article 15 now everyone have seen that movie is article 15 in this movie uh, the article 15 movie also give uh, the same message there is a social equalities and equal access to the public properties okay so we definitely uh, go to the public place like a temple mosques or uh, then after the public park every people go any part of the any part of the public place oh there is no restrictions for the any gender or any other caste then after here the special mentions for the state need to take cons- uh, special provision for the women as well as the children because if women is strong women special provision for the women that definitely good impact on the societies and moreover the children also so here the equal rights there is no discriminations on based on color the genders no discrimination at all every persons have a equal chance to access everything okay then after article 16 equality in the methods of public employment public employment is means about the job okay so here there is no discriminations here there is no discrimination for the job if your qualifications and you uh, clear the competitive exams then definitely you get that job okay and apart from this we need to uh, fit with the uh, the terms and conditions of the job okay then then and then uh, if we apply and we get the job here there is no discrimination suppose you applied in job and just because of just because of you belong from x category you cannot be get that job no not like that you fit as the terms and conditions of the described norm that means you are selected means equal chance there is no discriminations at all then after article 17 and article 18 uh, 17 there is untouchable pro, uh, untouchabilities and the titles so in this 17s and uh, is 17 that is practice to be untouchability is offense anyone's doing is un, un, un uh, punishable by the law if you are break any things definitely we get the punishment and the title which means we cannot be take the any title from the foreign so citizen of india cannot be accept the title from the foreign states okay so this is a rights to equality article 12 to article 18 now next now next article that is 19 rights to freedom rights to freedom 19 to 22 article number 19 to article 22 which relevant with the rights to freedom rights to freedom now we have a freedom of speech we have a freedom of expressions means person can be say anything there is a individual thinking the person can say anything okay there is no restrictions at all person can make their assembly also but without arms just for the peaceful environment person make the association definitely we make the union why just to benefit for the public interest morality and solvency and integrity of the people then after the equality in mat then after freedom to move freely throughout the territories of india means there is no restrictions at all you cannot uh, can not travel like uh, if you want to go out state you can easily travel but within the territories of india they start with the jammu kashmir uh, to the kanyakumari okay so any part of the uh, india you can easily go easily stay and you can do a business also you can start a job also okay so freedom of residence and settle in any part of the territory of okay? a settle means you can easily go do the job and uh, you can settle over there 
okay so these constitutions these rights to freedom uh, which for you which is for all okay it's work like a safeguard it's work like a safeguard and again we if we need to start a business but business must be the business must be the moral and it is not dangerous for the society so here in article 19 itself mentioned that the freedom of practice of any professions to carry any occupations trade or business it means we can start any business but make sure that make sure that the uh, business should be legal so the no rights to carry a business which is dangerous or immoral immoral suppose i want to start a drug uh, dr uh, drugs business in this uh, for example gujarat region so the state cannot be approved my job business why because it's immoral and it is a dangerous for the people okay so it is not the right then after article uh, 20 that is respect of conventions of offense then uh, then after 21 that is protection of life and human and personal liberty so here we have a 34 liberties that rights for the electricity rights for water then after uh, rights to sleep again it's a part of it rights to sleep then after rights to shelters rights to health then after rights to free education up to 14 years of age right the all things mentioned in this personal liberty then again we rights to travel abroad right against the handicraft uh, handicrafting speeds of travel then after rights to uh, information rights to hearing right against the public hanging we have the 34 rights under this article 21 then after the important article which is article 21a article number 21a that is rights to education rights to education the government at putting in both the way in a fundamental rights as well as the fundamental duty education will find both the places so uh, first rule education is good for the nation and if we are educated well then the india in future in india calls it developed countries because education is a weapon where we can cultivate so many ideas where we can cultivate so many ideas so here uh, article 21a that is rights to freedom of read uh, rights to freedom for education for education 6 to 14 years there is a free education for all the citizen for all the citizen there is no restrictions at all that you cannot uh, go for the school because of you are x region no not at all any person can go to the school they take the basic knowledge that schooling up to 14 it's a totally free in a government sectors they provide the uh, uniform school uh, school bag then after the books okay even they provide the midday meals why because if we are healthy then and then we can focus on the educations so here the education that article 21a and the last one 22 that is right against the arrest of detention in certain cases okay now next is rights against the exploitations rights against the exploitations so we can see so many uh, small kids they're working around us they're working around us why just to earn us some lump sum money that's lump sum money now this is exploitation is totally prohibited in india okay if you see any small kids working sur surrounding you it means you go to the police stations or any appropriate channel and you can shoot against that particular person so right against the exploitation it is absolutions of the traffic of the human begin beginnings of the bigger forced labor then after the person cannot be work in a factories that below the 14 years below the 14 years the person cannot be work in a factories it's a mines it's totally prohibited it is totally prohibited and always to be punished by the law always to be punished by the law then after rights to freedom of religions rights to freedom of religions it means article 25 to 28 that we can easily accept any religions suppose i i right now i am in x religions and i want to convert from x to y is it equal but right? because with the secular words all the people get the equal rights doesn't matter you belong from x y or z doesn't matter right so the regional base every community have 
uh, they can set up their charitable institutions by their own just to protect this, uh, their culture, their self-interest of the people. Okay, but here we don't want to spoil, we don't want to say any negative things about the another cultures, another religions. Okay, so no person shall be completely to the paid uh, tax on the promotion of the particular religions. A state run these institutions can be import the education for the pro religions pro religions and the cultural rights next is article 29 to 30 29 to 30 that is cultural and educational rights cultural and educational rights now here all the minorities all the minorities religions religions they can establish their own educational institutes just to prevent and develop their culture prevent and develop their culture so we can see all the minority they have their own school just to develop their own cultures just to develop their own cultures okay so cultural and educational rights and rights again the last article which is article 32 35 which is relevant with the rights to constitutional remedies rights to constitutional remedies so, suppose uh, suppose uh, if i say you don't want to go for the votes if you complete your 18 years and even though i am not allowing to go for the giving a votes okay so you go to the court go to the proper channel and show against me why why because we have a rights to constitutional remedies if any person cannot be get that any rights what i have discussed from article 12 to article 30 you can go to the supreme court and get that rights get that rights okay so this is up to that article 32 so these are the fundamental rights article 32 to article 35 article 14 to 18 which relevant with this rights to equality 19 to 22 for the freedom then after rights against the exploitations rights to freedom of religions then after cultural and educational rights and constitutional remedies constitutional remedies so this is all about the fundamental rights okay thank you class